Well, hello, hello, everyone. How are you doing today? Hope y'all are doing good. So, 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 today, we continue our musical adventure. Oh, yes. So last time we left off, we were in a frog town. It was weird. But yeah. Well, let's go ahead and continue, shall we? Let's just hop on over to here. And run the game. Yeah, yeah. Atlas USA. Caro Town. And our goal was to find the, was it the Thunder Elemental thing? Welcome! This is the Kingdom of Frogburg. Ah. Uh, I'm just gonna go in your house. I heard that Mallory captured or kidnapped the prince. Humans are so weird. I don't see any other frogs kidnapping each other. There's a toad in here. Do you really care about the toad? Is it toad she doesn't like or is it frogs too? A girl wearing a cat costume came over and released a fish in the pond. Since then, Boo Boo and Bebe started showing up in the pond. Huh? Found an energy candy. I've yet to use a single item, by the way. <laughs> How's it going, Nathan? The Centaur's Temple is a ruin of ancient culture. Supposedly, one of the five hot stones is there, the earth stone. But if you remove it, we all die. That's a goddess statue? Interesting. It's just a frog. It's filled with nice Shintani that Hannibal the Cannibal oh, would be proud of. Okay. Go through the temple to the west to reach Frogburn Castle. Okay. Don't tell anyone, but some of us don't like humans. But they're too stupid to realize that humans will hate them, too. Nice. I'm doing pretty good, Nathan. How about yourself? Ah, oh, yes, a human. I'm collecting monsters. Would you like to sell me one? No. When you find a rare monster, sell it to me. Hey, guy. Love goes beyond just physical attraction. I guess even a monster could be in love. Uh-huh. Ah! More toads? Oh, my God. How dare they put toads in barrels? It's very rude of them. A miniature action figure on the shelf. Yeah, that's all? Okay. I approve. Get into this one. Let me get some more toads. Oh no! Inodium. Nice. What you got in your drawers, huh? Anything? Nope. <laughs> the owner of this house, for uh, Korgama, is engaged to the princess. He told me to take care of his house while he's gone. Okay. Is this an item shop? Oh, it is. Hello, Frog Frog. Oh, no. Boo Boo and Bebe are living in the pond, so we can't get to the castle. Let's go to here, Nathan. The rich frog people don't like to deal with different cultures. This town is the only place where frog people and humans can interact. Welcome. Okay, what do you got for me? A thinking cap and a hero's charm, which does 200 in defense. Yeah, I was expecting like some better items here, but apparently not. Okay, bye. There's Boo Boo and Bebe ahead. They eat frog people and humans. Are you still going? Yeah. Are you really going? No. I guess humans aren't as dumb as they look. Wow. Yeah, I'm gonna go. Yeah, I'm really gonna go. Alright, any last words before you go? Yeah? If you don't have confidence in yourself, then you shouldn't go. Are you fucking with me, kid? <laughs> God damn it. Yes. Yes. No. Please be my guest, and... May you have happiness in another world. Frogburn Castle. I'll just murder them all. Mm -hmm. Ew. Look at this, Cornette. It looks like someone was using this pond as a bathroom or something. 
OMG, just what I wanted to hear. Don't worry, Boo Boo and Bebe shouldn't be too much of a problem. Unless. Did you see that? I don't want to see it. <laughs> it must have been a figment of my imagination. Go get him, Cornette. I'll just be over here if you need me. What did you mean by that? Well. Oh my. There they are. Well, let's murder them then. Alright, so. This should be an easy one-two punch. Because I'm assuming they're still only level like five. Right? Holy! Ah, oh, that's not going to hit, is it? We can do it anyway. So we can hit one of them, but that's fine. Yep. I knew it. Can he move further up? He cannot. That's fine. <clears throat> Giga Meteor! Oh. This one survived, huh? Didn't do anything, though. And your turn. Move up. Magic. Saint. Oh, yeah, they only got like 150 health, huh? Easy peasy. Hey, Grenette leveled up. Nice. Well, that was easy. Let's continue onward. Ooh, spooky. And following our tradition of always going the right path first. Hey, treasure. Illustration 9. Nice. We'll look at that later. Oh, that's a dead end. Well, that's fine. What level are these guys right now? Level 20? Not even worth it. Ah, oh, damn it. Ah, oh, I forgot to run away. They can't even hit me, they're so low. Okay, now we escape. Failed! Okay. You wanna play that game? We'll play that game. Magic! Holy. Y'all chose death! Only 500 experience, too. It's not great. Alright, going down. To the left. Oh, another way down. I almost went back up. Oopsie. Am I just going to the castle? Is that where I'm headed? This is a long path. Time to escape. If they were level 30s, I'd consider fighting them, but they're like half my level, almost. It's not really worth it. Sonic shoes, nice. And more the same. Oh, you're gonna regret this. It's a good thing you can't dodge magic, huh? No. Right, right. And up we go now. Uh, to the right. And now down. I feel like I'm going in a huge circle. Wait. To the right first, yeah. I'm going right. Now go down. What? Ha! Huh? Okay. I don't know how I got back to the same place I was at, but... Same exact way I came in. That's sad. Well, did I go south here before? 
I did. So let's... Come on. Bye. Alright. Let's go back. Up here. Over here. Ah, dead end. Okay. Try to remember where we came from this time. So I think I need to go in here. Over to here. Over to here. Oh my gosh. What weird little uh, monsters those are. It's like human fairy things. Huh. I think I came from the left before? My map of the place got messed up since I looped around. Oh, hey. Uh, let's... Let's go look at the item right here. We got... Illustration 9. Which is just Cornet walking... Through the forest. Okay. Alright, let's save. Excuse me, frogs, I would like to pass, please. I've heard of your bravery. Your victory over Boo Boo and Bebe has pleased our king. I'm sure your gratitude the king has prepared a feast in your honor. You're the first human ever to be received by this kind of welcome. Okay. You are the food. Ha 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 We were expecting you. The banquet is ready. Please come in. Man, you kill like three monsters and suddenly like everyone is in your debt, huh? This reeks of a trap though, right? We were expecting you, Miss Cornette. Gero, gero. I am King of Frogberg. To your right is my wife. To your left is my daughter, Caroline. Did he not introduce his wife's name? The lives of many frog people were lost to the Boo Boo and Baby. But now we can live without fear. Thank you very much. We have prepared a banquet in your honor. In the time it took me to get through the cave, they created a banquet, huh? Let the festivities begin! What the? What is this? The soup is filled with mosquitoes. Uh, Cornet? Uh, she passed out. First off, the soup. The soup is based on mushroom sauce sprinkled with fresh mosquitoes. Isn't it tasty? But there aren't many mosquitoes around anymore. Cultivated mosquitoes just don't uh, taste quite as good as the wild ones. Mosquitoes out in nature are the best. Do you like it? No. Is that so? Then let's go on to the next dish. This delicacy is called dancing flies. The flies flying around in your mouth give it that extra tangy flavor. Yes, just open the lid and slowly catch the flies with your tongue. Huh? Do you like it? No. Ah, uh, is that so? We have plenty of food to be brought out. Uh, oh, no, no. I've had enough, thanks. Well, that just means more for us. Maybe you'll like our song instead. Prepare the song! more of a dance than a song so far. Of 
So, what do you think? Do you like it? Yes. I knew it. That song is my favorite as well. Cornette, you have a horn. Would you mind playing your horn for us? That's a great idea. Miss Cornette, would you please let us hear your song? Yes, yeah, sure. That was really nice. This is the first time I've heard what a human, I hear a human song. Thank you very much. But uh, it was kind of difficult to understand. Not because you're old fashioned father. The song has touched my heart, Miss Cornette. Hmm. Wouldn't it be messed up if like that turned them all into puppets? Oh look, you must be getting tired. Miss Cornette, Miss Kudu, please have a good night's rest. So we can eat you in the morning. Yawn, I'm tired. Yeah, but I'm still hungry. Oh well, let's go get some rest. Beautiful flower in it. Hello, guards. The king is very fond of Princess Caroline, and he only wants the best for her. He's our king only, daughter. You know. Indeed. Which means she's probably gonna get kidnapped, ain't she? I'm glad that I can sleep in such a comfortable bed every night. Good for you, little guy. I found an elixir candy. There's a book here, and another, and another. Indeed. Ah! There's a toad in here. They didn't really show me to a bed, huh? Hey, little frog. You know what I saw? I saw Princess Caroline and Michael swimming together in the pond. <gasps> the scandal! I'm going to go and tell on her to her father. I have Minister Galanzo is missing. The people of Marl's kingdom hate him, but he's popular among frog people. He must have a face like a frog people. Like. Mm, it's weird. Social rank is held in high regard in Frogsburg Kingdom. The king had given Portagama noble status because he was smart. He thought that Portagama. That Portagama would be a perfect match for Carolyn. And yet she's seeing Michael. Hmm. Port Gama is a great guy, but he's kind of fruity, if you know what I mean. I don't think he can handle being king. Ooh, some more money. Okay. Back down, I guess. Going there. Going out here. One of these side rooms, maybe? Various glasses and bottles. A medicola. Medicola. A saint coming, huh? I only know a few ministers, but he's too concerned with the law. Go figure, books on a bookshelf? What did you expect to find? Found uh, Medicandy. That, for example. I know what people are saying behind my back. Princess Caroline's heart may not belong to me, but I love her more than anyone could. Ah, oh, so that's her fiance, is it? She left us the room of Portgama, fiance of Caroline. Portgama is known for his intelligence, frugalness and good manners but he's a negative five on the exciting scale a real bore you know i wouldn't want to marry him are you the famous miss cornett i've heard all your stories about your heroic deeds have you though like when i 
erupted a volcano, or when I, like, destroyed this one town's source of food and, like, income, and when I, you know, destroyed this worm that people were living in that wanted to, like, stay there, but I was like, nah, I need this thing. Those stories? I don't know, man. I... Hold on. Go through the temple to the west to reach Frogburn Castle. I really don't want to go back through there. So, is there another area in the castle that I just didn't see? Let me double check. Anything can go to the left? No? Okay. Oops, controller freaked out for a second. Oh. Breaking into the royal Frogburg castle. This is a crime punishable by death. What's going on? Your Majesty, we caught this thief breaking into the castle. Is that Michael? Mm -hmm. Isn't he the one who was singing earlier? Why him? Father, I love him. Michael. I knew it. My queen, do you know who this degenerate? Uh, no, 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 I don't. What's going on? Michael! P princess! Father, I love him. We're going to elope. He's my special friend, wink face. Car princess Carolyn? Is that so? Then why didn't he come to the front door? Even if he's a friend of the princess, he has no right to sneak in. Guards, take him away. How unfortunate. Please wait, father. I'm in love with him. I want to marry him. Wh what? You're already engaged to Fort Gamma. This is unacceptable. I didn't choose him, father. I want to make my own decisions. Are you insane? That man shall be executed. Please, father, let Michael go. No. Then I'll kill you, father. <laughs> I beg you, father. No, not another word. Please listen to her. You too? So, you knew about this? Caroline has her own happiness. Nonsense. What would happen to this kingdom? Who would take my place after I'm gone? Mother, please. Please help Michael. Please, dear. Is this a conspiracy? Your Majesty, I may interject. Why don't you make him go get the Earth Stone? If he were brave enough to retrieve it, would that please you? He can't possibly. No one has ever gone after the Earth Stone and come back. It's suicide. That's fine. Do you accept? Yes, if it means that I get to be with my beloved by doing so, so be it. All right, then. Go to the Earth Stone. Okay, Mom, bye. Michael, why? The centaur won't let you just walk out of there. You'll be killed. I would endure a thousand deaths for you. No, I won't let you. You won't survive the battle with the centaur. Who's that behind you? Oh, look, it's Cornette, the serial killer of the world. Cornette, you saw what was going on. Uh, not really. Miss Cornette, will you please go with Michael to retrieve the Earthstone? I know I'm asking you a lot, but since you've defeated Boo Boo and Bebe, you're the only one strong enough to help him. Please, Miss Cornette, you're my only hope. Yes. Thank you, thank you very much. Mm. Michael, here, 
Take this charm with you. It'll protect you. Please come back to me. Right people and humans are no different when it comes to stuff about love, huh? Caroline, I promise. I'll see you soon. Michael. <clears throat> oh, God. Oh, God, he just entered me. Oh, Jesus. Cornette, please take care of Michael. Thank you. So now do we have the uh, ability to go to dun 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 dun, dun the Temple of Gamma. Interesting that it's the Temple of Gamma and not like the Temple of Well I mean, it's it's Pagama, right? That guy's name. Like okay. Like Pagama? I don't know, whatever. Anyway, we'll just continue on our journey to the right. Just go this way. Uh, up there. And down the stairs! Ooh, spooky, spooky stairs. Actually, real quick, I am going to save. Since uh, we did do a lot of dialogue there, and I don't want to do it again. We're almost level 40. That's when the real fun begins. To the right. And then back. Now we got up, please. <laughs> oh my god, what if I turn Michael into a puppet? Yo. I was about to say, it's really strange we haven't seen anything monster-wise here. So. Yeah. What level are they? 22? Well, meant to end, but I didn't hit the up arrow again. So, they're gonna die. Y'all gonna die, baby. Bye-bye. Although, can't hit level 40 if you don't kill things, right? I think I was going north. Wow, did I actually? Okay. Roar! That, uh, centaur is... Woo! Stuff of nightmares. It's like a half horse, half frog, huh? Here, Shant uh, Shantae. Oof. Wrong game, huh? Magic! Holy! Ah, uh, man, I can only hit two of them? That's a shame. God of Destruction, go! Magic! Giga Meteor! I didn't do much damage to him, huh? I did kill that one, though. Excellent. Charge forward! And use justice to give yourself a power up for next turn. You dare attack me? What an attack, huh? That whole four damage, huh? Up here. You saint. Nice. Let's see. Confuses an enemy. Poisons an enemy. Inflicts damage. I think Giga Meteor's going to just Let's do poison. Miss. You know, Legem is kind of weak for a god of destruction, ain't he? Maybe I'll switch him out with a different person. Holy crap, that was 400 damage. Oh, he backed up. Uh, let's just play my horn again. Why not? Do, 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 do. Alright, prepare to die, son. Mega Meteorite! Easy peasy. Hey, Chris, level 40! Claps all around. Acquired Earthstone. Cornette gave the Earthstone to Michael. I'm gonna need that back after a moment, though, okay? Just so you're aware. Well, I suppose I could just... Actually, I probably can't teleport out of here. 
Okay. Who else can I swap him out with? El Kuna doesn't really fight well. Terra, who's the same type. Dark Knight, Koro. Which one was Koro? The dog, right? Yeah. Which one's Chiba? Flare was the dragon. Kid was the knight. The dark knight. Koro, Billy. Could we use Koro? Have that lightning and see what he does, you know? Alright, let's make a save. Cuz I'm sure we're gonna see that cat lady again and we're gonna fight her. Okay, let's go. Teleporter, go! Okay, bye. Out of the way, frog. I've got important information. An earth stone. There you go, he's got your earth stone. I've returned, sir. So, did you bring the earth stone? Yes. Nani? My beloved, you kept your promise to come back to me. Caroline. You have done well. Now execute him. Your courage will be remembered by the people of years to come. As I promised, I'll approve your marriage to Caroline. Thank you very much. However, you still have to pay for your crime of breaking into the castle. What? And you also killed Centaur, the guardian of Frogburg Kingdom. Wow. What? What? You must be punished for the crimes against the kingdom. As such, you are king now. Oh, that's not what you promised. I've kept my promise. Forgive me. What the fuck? I think we should just kill these frogs. Michael, no! What have you done? You monster! Michael! My true love. I'll never forgive you. I have no father now. Sob, sob. What if we turn him into a puppet, though? Hey, I want that body. What a tragedy. A Todd believe the king would execute his daughter's true love. Cherish every moment you have with your loved ones. You never know what might happen. Here's the earth stone. Random person. Wow. Uh, bye. Nah. How you, how you doing, Caroline? Michael. Queen? Poor Caroline. That's all you gotta say? Just poor daughter, huh? Not, holy fuck, my husband's a horrible person. Where's that frog boy at? I'm murdering him. Actually. Nope, he's gone. Okay. Well, I guess... I'm just gonna... <clears throat> go to Cape Hope. Maybe. Let me go to the Tower of Wisdom first. Since now I think I have all the stones, right? I should be able to be like, yo, old man. Oh, I was waiting for you, meow. Oh, look, the cats. Thanks for collecting the stones, meow. Now, I don't have to go look for them. Meow, meow, Miss Meow's genius. Meow. <laughs> Who's the woman? Miss Meow's the best. Of course, meow. Miss Meow's beautiful. Of course, meow. Miss Meow's selfish. Of course, Meow. Miss Meow's immature. Of course. Hey, wait a minute. Meow, sorry, Meow. Should we come back at a better time, Cornette? Wait, Meow. Don't ignore me, Meow. What do you want? I've told you that I need Meow. Hand over your stones to me, Meow. Why? Meow? 
Don't make me repeat myself, meow. You are doing this on purpose, right, meow? Uh, yeah. Meow. I'm mad now. I ain't gonna forgive any of you, meow. Watch out, Cornette. I think she's getting mad or something. Of course, Kudadoo. All right, old lady. Let's teach you this lesson again. Actually, I got an idea. <clears throat> Pancakes! Oh, I missed. Well. How about you miss Mega Saint, motherfucker? Oh, cool. This is one of those I can't kill her things, huh? Yep. Yay, even though I'm so much stronger than her, I can't kill her. Yay. Well, I guess we'll just end turn over and over again until we die. It's gonna be a long battle, especially since I can't actually kill her. Oh, so she just knocked Cornette down and did like 11 damage even though she has so much more health. That's ridiculous. <clears throat> You're next, be prepared. Ready? Go, meow. Oh, look, it's the goddess. What's this light? Meow, it's so bright. Meow, retreat. I got tired of my voice, I'm sorry. Ah, Cornette. What the? That face. I thought I recognized that face. I should check it out. It totally was just fucking standing by. What? She could have helped me, but she was like, nah, fuck that bitch. Are you okay? Huh? Where is... where is... I don't know what happened to the voice. Nailed it's time for lunch and went home. Huh? Lunch? Figures. Well, at least nobody got hurt and the stones are safe. Kudurudu, are you the goddess? Hey, old man. Wonderful, you have all the stones. So we can do the spell on the prince with all this, right? Huh? Well, it's just that alone's not enough to break the spell. <laughs> Excuse me? Could you run that by me one more time before I kill you, like everyone else I've ran into? Huh? You didn't hear me the first time. All right. I'll repeat it again, so listen carefully. That alone isn't enough. To break the spell. Got it? What? Then why did I have to go through all the trouble to find these stones? Get a rope. We're gonna hang this old man, let's go. No. No, hold on, hold on. Let me finish. Mallory and her underlings are in a floating castle called Beauty Castle. And you play, when you place the stones on the altar, you'll be able to enter the castle. Why didn't you say so? You had us both worked up for nothing. Well, maybe if you listened once in a while, you would have heard me. Anyway, in order to undo the spell on the prince, you'll need true love. True love? Yes, the spell can only be broken by one who truly loves him. By one who truly loves him? And how do you suppose I go about doing this? Should I just go up? To him and say I love him, or... Oh, it's much simpler than that. All you need is a kiss. A kiss? Yes, a kiss indeed. Something that you young people do on a daily basis. Fucking kids in their PDA and their nonsense like that. Oh, you're, you're talking. Hold on. A kiss? But I couldn't possibly. We haven't even begun on a date. Heck, we haven't even talked for more than five minutes. Cornette and Ferdinand sitting in a tree. K I S S I N G. I think you're qualified. You wouldn't be here if you didn't love him. It's just a kiss. It's not like you have to marry him right then and there. Then he'll have to take care of you. 
You can't get something for nothing. All right. Now that we know how to undo the spell, let's go to the K-Pope. Why'd she say it like that? Oh, Kududu. What's wrong with her? Kududu. Hey, calm down. Hmm, she has a fever. She must have overexerted herself. Have you noticed anything odd about Kududu? Not that I know of. Hmm. I did. At the entrance of the tower, bright light, wings like an angel. I see, is that so? I didn't know she could exist like this. What? What's that supposed to mean? Is Kururu going to be alright? Hmm, so Kururu turned into an angel earlier, right? Yeah, so? Cornette, Atole, journey into Kururu's dreams and see for yourself. <laughs> And that's the magic words to get into anyone's mind. Is that a, a tole on the bed? A tole? Huh? Are you her friend? Uh, yes, I guess. Hmm. Cornette? Yeah? How do you know my name? Huh? huh? This puppet is called Kuduru. Isn't it cute? Huh? Your name's Cornette too? What a coincidence. Her name is Cornette as well. Oh, there's too many female characters. They're all starting to blow together. No! Then this must be... Yes, this must be... You must be tired. Please stay here and get some rest. Cornette, why don't we go downstairs? Why? Cornette wants to talk more with big sisters some more. Not tonight, Cornette. They're tired. There's always tomorrow. Okay? Okay. So is that Cornette's mom? Why are you crying, Cornette? I'm not crying, just... Just what? Even though this is a dream, I'm glad I was able to meet her like this. What did I do to deserve this? That's what happens when you get involved. Okay, let's get out of here. This beautiful vase, not that it matters. Wow. There's a book called The Wonders of the Ancients. Ah. Yep. Hey, there's that giant cat making puppets. Give soul to the puppets. Huh. Hey, Grandpa. Huh? Sherry? She went to the church. Has anyone told you you look a lot like her? <laughs> Uh-oh. Is it over? This isn't your simple everyday earthquake. Could it be the ancient weapon? Ah, never mind. Forget what I said. Big Cornette. Should I play the horn for you? Yeah, do it. Listen to Cornette, okay? You're pretty good. Who taught you? My mommy. Is that so? Your mom must be really nice. Of course. Cornette loves mommy. Yeah, you really do. Cornette, let's go play. Okay. Yeah, we're planning on exploring the woods together. Do you want to come with us? It'll be really fun. Wow, that sounds exciting. But we're kind of busy now, so maybe some other time. Grown-ups always making excuses like, there's no time or maybe later. <laughs> what a brat. And on top of that, she's got stuff hanging out of her nose. I'd hate to see what grown-up she, what she grows up to be. Okay, let's go by ourselves, Etole. Yeah, let's do that, Cornette. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> That's a tole. A brat, didn't you say? <laughs> she got stuff hanging out of her nose. I need to see what she grows up to be. <laughs> I can't I can't stop laughing. <laughs> no, that can't be me. I refuse to admit that she's me. No way. How's it going, sir? I heard they used some crazy weapon to defeat the enemy. It's supposed to be a soldier made out of iron. I still don't believe it. Can I go to the store? Excuse me, pardon me. Yo, can I buy stuff here? Can I? Just cat pops, damn. Not even in a flashback they had good money, or good stuff. How's it going, Skashi? songs Are you guys all right? Uh, that song. Oh, were you listening? How embarrassing. It's a lullaby that the ancients used to sing. I always sing it to my daughter. Mom. Huh? Oh, don't mind me. I was just talking to myself. Yeah, that's it. Another earthquake. This one feels like a big one. Is it over? I have a bad feeling about this. Girls, have you seen my cornet? Uh oh. That's not good. Hey, kid. Who the, who the hell are you? Cornet, cornet. Wow, wow, wow. Why is Atola here crying? I'm glad uh, the war's over, but how can Glonzo take all the credit? I don't think he did anything at all. Yeah, same. Hmm. What? Connect at the church? That can't be. And that underground path? Sherry! Will you please go after her? If anything has to do with Cornette, she goes nuts. I have to get my weapons, so please stop, Sherry. You got it, Grandpa. Out of the way. Here I come to save the day. Cornette, Cornette, wah, wah, wah. Cornette's in here. Uh-huh. That's all right. You don't have to cry. Just wait here, okay? Cornette, Cornette. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Let me in. Is it this place? Oh my god, it is. Huh? What? Cornette. My Cornette. <laughs> Mommy. How did I get here before her mother? You aren't supposed to be down here. I, I know. Don, somebody's here already. Just when I found the ancient weapon. Thank you for coming to help my Cornette. 
I'm sorry to make all of you worry. Hey, but, uh... It's... it's still alive. What's that sound? I have a bad feeling about this. Run! Watch out! Cornette. Time to bring up the big guns, girl. I'm okay. I remember now. My mother didn't die in an accident. It's the thing here that killed my mother. Cornette. You're not thinking about taking this thing on, are you? You do know that there's no way that we'll be able to defeat it, right? Then don't. This is a weapon created by the ancients. I know that you don't want to want to avenge the death of your mother, but it's not that easy. Mother. I know this is just a dream. I know that I'll never get my mother back, no matter what I do. I understand that. But at least, at least in my dreams. <laughs> okay, okay, I guess. Katole. Let's go! Got it. Meanwhile, the old man's outside standing over their uh, unconscious bodies like, Huh, I forgot to tell them that if they die in their dreams, that they die for real. I hope nothing bad happens. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. Let's go. Why is there a knight down here? Oh. Uh, charge forward! Excalibur! How very rude of him. Okay. Shockwave! Oh, that did nothing. And that uses all of his magic, too. Excellent. Let's move Cornette here. Not from Horn. Horn! Can't move her here. And... Giga Saint! 2-2-2. Two, two, two. Not bad. Alright. Duke! Time to attack! Holy Slash! Nice! Boop, 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 boop. Oops, too far. Hold on, back it up. And there we go. Kodo, do your weak attack! And that will miss, yep. That's what I thought. Good job. Alright. Buck Duke. Excellent. And I'll cast Giga Saint again. Actually, let me check how much health. Oh, we're all we're all really good. Yeah, we got this. Let's go attack normally. Ooh. Okay, the buff definitely helps. One damage. Nice. Uh-oh. Well. Oh, okay. Jesus Christ, Atole. Finish him, Cornette. Oh. That, that's fair. Finish it with another Giga Saint. Hey, we win. Koro should level up a couple of times there. Perfect. He's still like 20 short, but... Yes! <gasps> Nani? Watch out! And she died again. Huh? Mother! Mommy! I'm sorry. I'm really sorry because of me. You... You don't have to apologize. You... You just showed great courage. I hope my daughter grows to be like you. Mommy, please wake up. Cornette, remember, I'll always be with you, always. Until you find happiness, Cornette. Please play your horn for Mommy. <laughs> okay.
Don't cry, Cornette. I'll be... I'll be with you. Ancient gods, please grant me my last wish. Yo, she was totally a goddess though, right? She's like the goddess statue, right? And that's how Kururu was born. Oh, I see. You are my angel. You are my everything. You mean more than anything. When I see you smile so lovely and bright, makes the Such a little girl, but in my eyes you are the one. I wish you health and happiness for all time, and may the world be kind. Whenever you are feeling down, whenever you. Hey, you're finally awake. Sage Polanski. Cornet, this will be difficult for you to hear, but you must know the truth. Okay, but please don't tell Kururu. I agree. If you want to know the truth, go to the gate of the netherworld. There's the key you need. Know your limits, Cornet. Receive dark key. Hmm. Cornette, I, I had a dream. A scary dream. But you came and rescued me. Kududu. Oh yeah! We're going to Cape Hope, right? Come on, what are we waiting for? I'm alright. No, no. You must get some rest. Huh? But... He's right, Kududu. Don't worry about me, I'll be okay. Alright, if you say so. I'll catch up with you later. Yeah. Cornette? You'll be truly happy if you save the prince, right? No. You'll be happy. I just know it. Go on. I'll catch up later. Matole, please take care of Cornette for me. Huh? Uh, I got things to do, that's right. I gotta wash my hair, that's it. Gotta run, ta-ta! So, can we just go to Cave Hope, put all the things in, and like bypass the whole going to uh, this place? Is that a thing we could do? I'm not going to, but let's see what happens. I'm assuming the dark keys for this place. Meow. It feels so weird not having Kudu do like right behind me. Okay, before we go inside. We save. I should have 90,000 or 70,000. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, let's go. So that was a dream, and we uh, didn't actually kill that thing. I'm assuming we're going here to kill it now, right? Okay. We need to get some experience for uh, Kodo. So I will kill these things. Kuro leveled up. Okay. I don't want to go down yet.
We'll explore a little bit here. Okay. Let's go right first. Empty. Okay. South has an exit. Okay. Looking like we're... Uh, have a lot of dead ends with nothing in them, huh? Drive up. Move up. And use holy. We can get Koro to level uh, 20, 25 ish. He should be good. Hey, treasure chest. Illustration 10. We'll look at that later. Is it just me or does it seem like the place that we have to like go to like exit is always just right across from us? It's like now it'll just be up north, right? Yeah. I don't think it's, maybe it's not even worth like checking all the rooms. Although, <clears throat> extra steps means extra monsters. We also need to get Cornet's horn uh, stacks up higher, I guess. So. Bye bye bye. Treasure chest. A charm of valor. Well, we can look at the uh, illustration 10. Oh, it's that dragon that they smashed in to the kingdom with, isn't it? Okay. Charm of Valor. Offense plus 30. Oh, I don't know who to give that to. Duke! Hmm, Dolores' agility at the cost of giving him 30 more offense? I think I do. Also, Kodo needs some stuff, so let's give him the cat's paw, the speed shoes, and the sonic shoes to make him go really fast. I'll just do a save since we came a little ways. Alright. We're just going deeper and deeper, huh? queen lady and some fat demon things. Die! Oh, so you survived, did you? Not for long! Special swipe attack! Oh my gosh, his normal attack is 400 now? That's great. That is, that is great. That's gonna be a, a real nice tool to utilize to destroy our enemies. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Controller? Okay, there we go. <laughs> this is a very deep long, very uneventful dungeon. Illustration 15. Oh boy, when will it end?
Only light! Somebody can't attack Kitty Corner. Nice. Might as well use justice. Oh man. Not enough. Oh no. Only 50? That's fair. I guess. Okay. We came from the north, right? Yeah. Oh, ah, damn it. I was so used to stuff being empty that I just forgot about the, uh, chest there. A lot of illustrations in this dungeon. Okay, seriously though? I feel like I'm in the Lost Woods and it's just like going in circles at this point. Charge forward, Duke, and swipe attacker. There we go. Excellent. Hey, a chest. Nice. Magic robes. Ooh. Okay, so we got illustration three, right? Hey, it's a tole. So we also got 20, didn't we? Or it's 15, right? Which is uh, Cornette, Mallory and her hench people, and the uh, prince. Oh, hey! The uh, wolf, the wolf girl's name was like Gao or something like that, right? She has red hair in this one. And the other lady, the middle one, she appears to have shorter hair and no wings. Hmm. Magic robes increases de reduces magical damage by half. Ah, why would I want that? Because I can give it to Duke and just stack his uh, defensive capabilities. Because his uh, physical damage taken is reduced, right? Okay. It has been a long journey down this hallway. I don't want to go back up. Maybe like a teleporter or something. Ooh, this should be some bad experience for us though, I think. Maybe. Oh. Hello to everyone. Let's do Shockwave. Uh-oh. These guys are a little bit strong, huh? Really, you're using Saint on a holy character, huh? Alright. 
finish him off. Bye bye. That was some good experience. I will give it that. Get back out. To the left and then down. Ugh, man. Where we go on? Not Coral gain full health. Okay. Save another time. Huh. Oh man, Rapper got on the stairs. How rude. Oops, uh, back up. One character. Duke was over one. Damn it. No, give me back to Koro. Oh, well, whatever. I'll let him just go here. Use justice! How dare you attack my healer? Well, more like my damage dealer, to be honest, but. Bye. And leveled up to. Excellent. Alright, I was going down. No. A dark stone? Is that an equipment piece? No? Dark Antonium Crystal, what? It's a key item, huh? Oh, it was taking a little bit longer to load there. I thought it was a cutscene. Uh-oh. It is taking a little bit longer to load now, isn't it? really uh training me isn't it oh they're level 32 now oh this is bad they're actually our level we'll have to fight tactfully here Shockwave! Didn't do much damage, though. Need to level them up a lot more. Use justice. Why did that one not attack? Oh, he attacked and moved. Okay. doesn't seem to be that useful, though. He, uh, has one attack. And other than that, he's just fast. Wait, what? Thank you, Cornette. I can finally go home. 
My spirit leaves, my puppet is yours. Cornette, I wish you well on your journey to save the prince. I didn't do anything. Exactly. Uh, why, why did he, why did he leave? Was me reaching this part, like, his goal? Oh. That's a teleportation pad? That's not. Okay, bye. Wait. No. Hold up. Are you meaning to tell me I'm going to have to go all the way back down because I chose to use the thing? back down from here? Ugh. Oh no, the game crashed. Weird how that works, huh? Well, I guess we'll just have to load up our game. to save with the top one, right? <laughs> Let me just check these. No. Okay, you know what? I think I might change Koro out for uh, someone else who has more levels. Like, I guess we'll just use Ledgim. Because he's the only one who's like actually going to be able to do anything in this fight, so we'll do that. Here's the dark stone, which I wonder if the dark stone is what triggers his uh thing. Okay. No. There was nothing else down this way, so we can just skip all this. Thank you, Cornette. I can finally go home. My spirit is yours. Bye-bye. Okay. And now, we'll save again. Actually, hold on. Equipment. What do you got? Okay, intelligence, defense, defense. Okay, that's fine. Save over the one we already saved over once. Bye bye. Okay. Hey, buddy. It seems broken. What do you mean it seems broken? So what was the point of me coming down here again? To just see that that thing was broken? I was expecting some like climactic clash between, you know, me and the thing, but uh, apparently that was a huge waste of time. And we'll be leaving now. What level are you guys? 25? You're not worth it, I'm leaving. Okay. We failed, huh?
weird. I was expecting us to, like, go down here since, uh, Kururu isn't with us. But, uh, I guess that. Well, let's just head on back out of here, then. I guess we're going to Cape Hope. We can go put all the stones in their sockets, right? Red spirit touched the orb spirit. What? Eh? Who the hell are you, dragon guy? Giga Saint. It's a thunder dragon, okay. We're just killing more animals for no reason. Oh. Well. Okay, bye. Place the thunderstorm on the altar? Yes. Place the thunderstorm on the altar. Excellent. So are we going to have to fight like a, a boss or like a mini boss, I guess, each time here? Can I spear touch the orb? Really good with just using normal saint if it only has that much experience or health. I mean, oh, ha! Well, I can't move past it. Fine. Move aside and attack normally. Oh my gosh, his normal attack does 200 damage. Nice. It's the windstone. I was expecting like something to actually appear in the altar, but apparently not. Do -do 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 -do. This is the Earth? No. I thought the Earth was the first one we did. Eh, whatever. about Mega Saint? Okay, that works. We'll Mega Saint them all to death then. First stone. Okay, bye. Now we got the water and the... No, we got the fire and the... Uh... What's the other one? Don't remember. Mega Saint! Isn't it an ice one? Yeah, I think it's an ice one. If I remember correctly. <laughs> Firestone's in the altar. So, this altar takes us to the Beauty Castle? It seems weird, right? Can I just pass by it? Nope. Okay. Survive. Finish him. Water stone. Oh, we already did the ice stone, huh? Okay. Whatever. Bye. So now do we just kind of go here? Yep. Da -da 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 -da. There's the castle. Oh, look, it's Gonzo. Well, what do we have here? A brave girl fighting against impossible odds? Meow, gow, 
Crodia, stop her at once. Yes, ma'am. I shall resurrect her before anything else gets in my way. Galanzo. Yes, ma'am. Give me a massage and clean the toilet after you're done. With your tongue. Get what you fucking deserve, sir. So do you think this is gonna be like a dungeon, or am I just gonna fight all these girls at once, or... What do you think? Let's go get our prince. Keep going like random directions until I decide that's good. Right. Ho oh, oh, ho. Oh. Okay. What level are you guys? 30? Oh. That's cute. Try a giggle holy. Just until I know they're hell. Oh. Well. How about a meteor? Yeah, because you guys have five health left. He has a hundred health left. Uh sure, let's do it. If the golden one lives, that's fine. Hell yeah. Nice. Go level five. Upstairs. Hey, look, it's that thing. The weapon. Wow, that's rude. Giga Holy. Don't give him a chance to attack, ladies and gents. Meteor! Bye bye bye. Cornette is 44. Excellent. Dragon's Claw. It does. Offense plus 20, huh? Oh. I'll place that one. There we go. Let's get her magic robes. Why not? Okay, before we go into that, obviously a, uh, Boss battle place, more than likely. Let's save. Okay. Charge! Who are we fighting first? Wait, it's a dead end? Nani? Okay. Well, who could have saw this coming? War was ended by like a giant iron thing falling from the sky, right? Does that mean Mallory stopped the war? Naturally. Huh. I might have to look up a map of this place because this is a little confusing. Uh, yeah, 
Yes, empty room is my favorite. Oh, hi. I thought they left. But they're just chilling here now? Welcome, little girl. Surprised that you made it this far. No one in Marl's kingdom would dare challenge me in my own castle. Hand over the prince or else. I don't think so, peasant girl. If you want him back, you must defeat me. The winner gets to keep the prince. You got three to one odds on Cornette. So, who wants to play some bets? Who said you on anyway? Come on, little girl, I'll show you what I'm made of. Behold the pallet of Marjorie. I wonder if, like, I was supposed to encounter the other three. Nope, never mind. Omega Meteor. Uh, am I dead? Yep, I'm dead. But hold on, because I have pancakes. We got one. No! You only have the one who can do AoE damage, huh? Okay, hold on. How much does she have? Not much. She has a lot still. She really has any. Okay. Here's the plan. Ha! Kill the bird first! Cha! Done. Item! I don't think I have a revive or anything, right? Yeah. Okay, which means... He can survive another hit. Burnett cannot. Oh shit, that was 5,000 experience. Ah, uh, crap. Can't move through her. Just move around slowly and attack uh, from the back. Go. Rude. Let's make sure we take Gao out. Okay. Oof. I don't think Krennic can survive another attack. So let's give her health. in here so she can't move. Oh, fudge. Well. This is not going great. Ha. Um. Let me think here. Sugar candy, fuck it, let's go. I think we're gonna lose this one, y'all. Just run away. Yeah, I won't be able to make it anywhere. Yep, and Ripperoni. Okay, so I'm actually supposed to be able to beat her here. Okay, I think I can. I just need to level up at least uh, my one gal a little more. If Charte has more defense or uh, the ability to survive the first attack, should be good. I saved over here. Okay. Well, that's fine. We gotta grind a little anyway, so. We'll be fine. Which way did I go before, though? I don't remember. Alright, I went this way. So I just gotta be careful not to go the same path until we level up Charte at least a couple of times. I think I went, did I go south or in first? It was literally just like a few minutes ago, but I already do not remember. Let's go this way. Okay. Can I get battles out here? Maybe not. There we go. our target here.
Holy. It survived, huh? Okay. How about a meteor, buddy? I feel like I'm 200 experience, though, unfortunately. Oh, she leveled up. Nice. Well. I wonder if that's enough to have her survive. Maybe we go one more level. See if, uh, if she gains one more level, we should be good. Really? Enough of the single, like, enemies. Actually, you know what? I want to escape. If there's going to be single enemies, I don't want to fight them. Because it's not worth the experience. Here we go. Okay. Giga Holy. up and uses Meteor. They all die. Much experience is had. Also, the other two can level up as well a bit while we uh, grind as well. A pink one, huh? I've not seen that one before. Strong, I'll give it that. It's a general. Apparently, the Shogun's stronger than the general, though. Excellent. So, as long as I can get Charte to survive the first attack that Marjorie does, I should win. If I can have all three puppets attacking at once, there's no way she'll last long. That's the problem. Come on. Come on. Come on, enemies. Come on, what you doing? What you waiting for? Let's go. Okay. Here we go. Oh, perfect. What's that one in the middle, though? I've not seen that before. SS Sharpshooter. And it's dead. Excellent. We're not leveled up. Duke leveled up. Okay. We're getting stronger. One more level for Charte and then we'll go. Uh, nothing like walking in circles to wait till enemies come at you, huh? Not here. There we go. Giga Holy! Didn't, uh. Let him get a new attack? Oh, Mega Charm. And Giga Meteorite, which is a simple target then. Okay. Samurai! There we go. Okay. Let's get out of here. And before we go down, open up the inventory. Chate's maxed out, everyone's maxed out. Perfect. Okay. I want to make sure everyone had full health, full mana. I know Legium has a little bit less than full mana, but that's okay. Okay, let's go. Okay. 
I'm actually gonna save here because I don't want to go all the way back <laughs> if we die. Let's go. Let's go to the four. Let's just fight. What? Why did she attack first? Huh? No matter. That's fine. I'm just going to move up one here. Let's do this. Giga! Holy... Oh wait, she can't hit her, huh? That's fine. Let's go. So I'm her here. Let's do Giga Meteor. Hit them all. Okay, that one's dead. I'm gonna use sugar candy. That takes care of her. I'm gonna use the Mega Heal All, just in case she does that huge attack on us. Here to trap her. And we're gonna use Mega Poison. Damn. Well, I can't hit her here, so we use Excalibur. And we'll get her next time. Oh man, we almost had her all surrounded, damn it. Burnett, move here. We're not going to let her escape. I'm going to use this on Cornet just to keep her healed. Because if she dies, I lose. And I'm not going to be about that life. No, no, no. Attack, magic. Hold on. Magic. All right, let's go Giga Saint. Easy. <sighs> She's gonna keep moving away. We'll just use Giga Meteor, right? I'm not gonna try to do the debuffs on her. It's not gonna work for sure. Now we attack. Yeah! Got her. Man, it's e it's crazy what just a couple of levels can do to like make your team so much stronger. Also, if the enemy boss does not start out with a huge AoE kill field. Hmm, I've underestimated you, little one. Now behold my true power. Uh, didn't you say the same thing earlier? Shut up, I mean it, true power. Stop. Enough of these foolish games. I was merely pretending to be your slave, but no longer. I will become the ruler of this world, and all of you shall die. Come to me, weapon of the ancients. That's the big metal thingy in my dream. Well, Kururu's dream, technically. What is this thing? How am I supposed to know? Ha 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 ha. This is what you were working on in the back, huh? Do you think that hunk of junk can possibly defeat the Magnificent Majority? Ha! Galanzo, you've already lost it. Ha! Now. Don't underestimate me, old man. 
Am I fighting with them now? Oh no, she's just gonna get her butt beat by it. Is that it? Giga Storm. Really? I'm not doing anything. The battle's just kind of going by itself. Am I able to do anything though? No. She's not even losing health. What is this power? This can't be. <laughs> now it's time to finish it off with my ultimate spell. Aha! Uh huh? Huh? I think I messed up. I can't believe I'm related to her. Huh. <laughs> I guess I win this round. All that's left will be the destruction of the prince and the world will be mine! He is good. Galanzo's the enemy, meow. Malgrave. I can't believe Mallory got beat. Well, how about I just go ahead and kiss the prince? Could have felt a strange and emanating power from the petrified prince. HP and MP recovered. Oh, cool. I guess I'll save, since we're uh, kind of in a, an intermittent here. Intermission between another fight, where Mallory apparently uh, fucked up. Uh, hey, hey, Glonzo, how you doing? Huh? What do you want from the ruler of the world? Why are you staring at me like that? You aren't thinking about fighting, are you? Of course I am. You impertinent little brat. We gonna sing a song? My prince, please give me your power. Mother, I'll pay them back ten times for what they did to you. Dun 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 dun. Move up first. Actually. <laughs> Pancake. Next, Charte. Go ahead and move up. You're going to use your Giga Holy on him to finish that guy off. And also deal a bunch of damage to the machine. Okay, Ludwig, move up. Oops. Attack. No, all magic. Yeah. Alright. Giga Meteorite. Let's go, baby! Didn't do much damage. Well, we'll move our knight up here. Use Excalibur. And wait to get ourselves beat up, I guess. Sixty-five damage. Oh, buddy. How about some Giga Saint, motherfucker? Ah, uh, magic. Another Giga Meteorite for you. That's fair. All right, finish it off, Duke. With your holy blade. Okay, I was not expecting to be 700 damage, but okay, that works. Cornette's now level 71. We leveled up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, how can this be? I was defeated by a little girl. I did it? That can't be. A girl. Aha! Magnificent. This is truly magnificent. This can't be happening. It was too strong for me. I, I can't do this alone. Don't give up, Cornette. Kururu, Atole. Kururu, Atole. I can't let you take all the glory, Cornette. <laughs> Fight, Cornette. Yeah, you're right. I haven't come all this way just to stop now. And I'm not alone. We can do this. 
Technically, the other three girls in the room could assist us as well, but they just don't want to, huh? Also, Kururu is not going to fight, so... It doesn't really matter a G-Laser, huh? Uh-oh. Not bad. A little worse. Okay. Move up and take him out. We need to recover some foreign power. Up to his side. Giga Holy! Alright, let's get the ads out of the way first. Giga Meteor to finish this guy off. Now we'll move him up here and attack. Oof. Just a little bit. Jesus. Atoli and her guns. I love it. Needs healed. I know what I'll do. Move her back one. Giga heal all. Or mega heal all, I guess. There we go. And the blue over here. Uh, Giga meteor. There we go. Knock him down. And now, with his back against the wall. I'll move up Duke. Hit him in the face. Good thing I healed. Stop running away. Okay, let's move her here. Giga Saint. Go. Ludwig will move over here. That way Duke can get in there and we get us trapped in the corner as long as Atole doesn't decide to move and let it out. You know what? I think I'll do Excalibur. I'll finish it next time. Your attack is no match for me. Let me move Cornette down one so she can get more people in her horn range. There we go. It's not attack. Magic. How's everyone's health doing? Uh, I think I'll heal. Just to be on the safe side. All right. Duke, I have faith in you. Finish him off with your holy blade. Got him. <laughs> nice. Learned. Le Le Leviathan? Huh. Wonder what that does. Good job, Cornette. See, Cornette, where would you be without me watching your back? Mother. Someone stop that man. And just where do you think you're going? Yeah, Gonzo. What's the big hurry? Teleport's right in front of you. Punishment, punishment. <laughs> Where, uh, did they go? Yeah, we, like, dropped him from 70,000 feet. He's dead. Hey, Cornette, give the prince a kiss. I think I know how this is gonna go. But let's just make sure. Smooch? 
nothing happened. Oh, man. Unexpected. I was, uh, I was expecting it not to work for Cornet, but then for Atole to be able to do it. Anyway, wh where am I? Oh, I'm glad he's safe. Is it time for a song? Cornette, where are you going? Don't you have something to tell him? I couldn't possibly. I've managed to come this far, but was I doing the right thing? We've gone through so much, and I've done so many things I regret. Do I really deserve to be happy? Wait. Are you going to make one more Percy unhappy then? Person unhappy? If you leave now, I'll probably never see you again. It would be a shame. To live a life without being able to share my love, or share the love that my heart holds for you. While I was dancing with you at the party, then, I noticed that all the other girls were looking at me as just a prince. No one really sees me as just a person. But you, Cornette, you are different from the rest. I knew right then that where you looked into my eyes, that you were one, you were... We've all done things that we often regret. Incidentally, Cornette always like, Oh, he's a prince. I'm going to get my prince. Yada, yada, yada. But <clears throat> we've all done things we regret. Just this once. Listen to your heart and stay with me. Take Coronet to be your lawfully wedded one. I do. Do you, Coronet, take Ferdinand to be your lawfully wedded husband? Yes, I do. You may now kiss the bride. Oh, they move. Where's it, Tole? Where is my bridesmaid? My, my head, what was the, what's the head bridesmaid name again? I forget what it's called. Okay, I can't go there. Do I just go this way? Wait, hold on, was that grandfather? Grandfather! Oh, what a beautiful bride you become. Your mother would be proud. See, now you've done it. I'm all starting to get misty-eyed. Eh, excuse me. That way, I guess I'm going this way. Are we going to the bathroom? Or are we just going to a balcony? Just like the balcony. Kudadu. I'm so happy for you. Goodbye, Cornette. Please, don't go, Mom. Cornette. I see. You know. You've become so strong, Cornette. Like I knew you would. Please, don't leave. I don't think I can go on without you. I was able to come back to you as Kurudu only until you found true love. Happiness, whatever. I'm happy being with you. There are people here who truly care about you, Cornette. Don't cry. People will come and go in your life. That's inevitable. You fought for what you believe in. That's all that matters. I'm proud to be your mother, Cornette. Mom. And that's how people grow up. I was happy to see you grow up through your journey, Cornette. Don't cry. Smile for me. It's going to be all right. We're one and the same, you and I. We'll see each other again. I promise. And besides, your prince wouldn't like the way you look. Okay. And that's better. You're always prettiest when you smile. Goodbye, Cornette. I'll always be with you. Mom. Hey! And 
That was the game. Wow. I, uh... Perfect fucking timing too, right? Ha. Ah. Incidentally, I was expecting something really sad to happen, but... Honestly, it didn't make me cry. No. I was a little sad at parts. Made me choke up, you know, when her mom died and all that, but... Yeah. Anyway, enjoy the credit song. Tell my story too, it's just begun. Our love will last forever. We'll share our lives as one. We have shared the laughter and tears through all of the years. We will say goodbye. Just for now, till we meet again. Thank you, my love. Thank you over and over. It warms my heart just to say it again. Thank you, my dear. It's so hard just to say goodbye. Tear and a smile. Thank you, my love. With all of my heart, you gave to me a reason to believe. Thank you, my love. From my heart, you filled my life with melody and song. You are the one I tell my story to. It's just begun. Our love will last forever. We'll share. Shared the laughter and tears through all of the years. We will say goodbye just for now till we meet again. Thank you, my love. Thank you over and over. It warms my heart just to say. Goodbye, but I will do it with a tear.
Thank you, Kururu. Thanks, Mom. Well, well, well. That was cute. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm waiting for it to do anything, or if I'm supposed to hit like a button. I don't want to like interrupt anything, you know? Oh, not that button. I'm hitting A and stuff. Okay, there we go. And back to the title screen. Okay, well! That, uh... That was the game. Every one. I guess uh, that'll be all for this video game. Ma, 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 ma. Let me just boop and boop. Let's switch over here. All right, everyone. Well, that was quite fun. I enjoyed that game. It uh, it was fun and cute, and uh, had some good messages in there. Some really dark stuff at times too. It, it got really dark. But it was like, let's just kill these dragons and take this, uh, this fire egg. And then the volcano's gonna erupt and kill, like, a bunch of surrounding wildlife and mess up the town a bit, you know? And then, uh, when we went after the, um, was it the ice stone? And it was like, oh, it's protected by these, like, nine-tailed foxes. And, uh, we used them for food and, you know... Were f w w wool, not wool, uh, fur to like uh, survive in the, the mountain climates, and it was like, ha, now nah, they're all dead now, bye. It's like, uh, we might be kind of bad guys, yeah, but don't mind me because I'm just your queen now. Oh, yeah, but yeah, it was very great. I enjoyed it. Um, it was a nice short game. I think we had what, like, this was the seventh session of it right question mark i can look Let's see there was one two three four oh this is the fifth oh yeah i guess it has only been like 10 10 hours we've played it so yeah 10 divided by two nice 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 granted there's a bunch of side stuff we could have done too well not necessarily a bunch of side stuff but like each puppet you can apparently get like their uh, soul to ascend and I don't know if that unlocks anything special or anything like that but that's a thing you can do and then that pretty much is all the, the side stuff I don't think there's any like, other side quests or anything there's that there is that one like dungeon right at the uh, hidden place that we went into that like has the uh, ancient weapon down there but like it's just there right I don't know if there's anything we can do with that. That's curious, right? I don't know. Anyway, everyone, that will be all for today. And that'll be all for Rhapsody, a musical adventure. And a musical adventure it was indeed. So, I will leave you all for today. And tomorrow, we'll be playing something else. I have an idea of what we're going to be playing. But, 
I need to make sure that it uh, set up, works properly and all that, and then we'll be going on another adventure kind of thing. Yeah, because there, uh, there haven't been any games coming out recently, so we're going to continue doing some other games that have been out for a while. Because I think the newest game that comes out that I want to play is like June something. So, uh, yeah. All right, everyone. Before I start to ramble on and on about nonsense, as I always tend to do, I'll catch you all next time. So if you've missed anything, you can catch the VODs of this entire series up on YouTube at youtube.com slash plagueandshiki. You can also follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash plagueandshiki for uh, announcements of when I go live and uh, just to see, like, adult stuff. Yeah. Like, R18, no kids allowed kind of stuff. And then also, if you're on YouTube watching this video, you can follow me on Twitch to actually watch these live if you, like, want to talk or anything. And uh, that's at twitch.tv slash Plague and Shiki. So uh, you'll notice everything ends in Plague and Shiki. So uh, it's very easy to know where my socials are at. Those are the only socials I got, though. So if you see me anywhere else, that's not me. And, uh, yeah. But bye for now. You all have a lovely rest of your day, night, morning, whatever. I will catch you next time. Bye-bye.